Hey, Charla, nice to meet you. How are you? Good. Good to see you again. It was wonderful to have you on my show, and now here we are on yours. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just talk about uh, elevator pitches. You know, what are they? Why are they so important? And remind our audience about, you know, how do uh, how should people refine and craft their elevator pitches? The elevator pitch is really the tip of all of your marketing um, strategy. When somebody, you know that I have a an actual podcast called Polish My yeah. Pitch. It's five minutes and people come on the show. And so when they show up, and I don't mean to put you on, on the edge here, but and it's it's really like a very 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 bad elevator pitch which means yeah. it's generic or it's really really long or it's unfocused or it's not pain based or it's just it's mostly about them um, and it, instead of their prospect it really shows me that they don't have it all together in the background of you know yeah. the under the I call it the tip of the iceberg. So under the water is where all of your communication and mo and some of your business strategy lies. So that's what it tells me is like the tip is your elevator pitch. So that is the first point of contact for a lot of people. Now, elevator yeah. pitches are being used on, in different contexts online. You have to reach out and you know what Mike and I were talking about before. What you and I were talking about is uh, online on LinkedIn yeah. how we're reaching out exactly. with just you know tweetable the messages you don't have to be yeah. tweeting but even in on, on um, email or voicemail it just it has to hook people so that's exactly. why it's so important